So guys, if you are trying to install Windows 10 or any other Windows on your PC and uh, you might be uh, facing the problem as the problem I am facing here. So I decided to give you the solution of that uh, problem as well. Let me just adjust that camera for you guys because uh, I am uh, capturing this with my smartphone. So I'm really sorry about the video quality yeah let me just do this i guess this is uh, right okay now so uh what i am uh, trying to say here is that uh, i am trying to i am facing some problem with my windows so i decided to install windows fresh okay so let me show you what i am facing right there is once uh, you can select the language you can click on install now I have messed up something inside of windows so, so this is why I am here to show you you can actually um, uh, back up your data which you want while you are installing Windows 10 so I'm just showing you that what I am facing right there so this is the first step which explains you the problem which I am facing as you can see here drive zero is unlocated space right there and we are getting this error message like this you cannot install on this hard drive because it is in uh, MBR format but you can install it into uh, in GPT disk so that means I have to uh, install Windows in GPT uh, drive which have GPT format so what I did before is I uh, I get this message so I decided to format that drive in order to install window but that message remains the same then I decided to delete the partition and uh, try to create a new uh, or try to allocate the space by clicking on new then let me show you that what is happening I'm gonna leave the size as it is then apply it gives me this uh, random message which you should not be worrying about this is just a general message while you are trying to creating a new allocated space so wait for it and uh, it will give you something special there we go so it says that you could not create a new partition error of something which I don't know what that mean is so I am pretty much uh lost it right there so because i cannot uh, delete i can delete but i cannot install because it is in mbr format and uh, i need to uh, retrieve my data which is inside other drives which is very important for me so there is the procedure where i can um backed up all my data and then i can because i can clean it by uh, opening cmd command uh, but which in turns leads us to wipe out the internal hard disk as well so you don't need you don't want that to happen so in order to back up your data while installing window there is the procedure which you have to follow so go back to the original install now window as you can see here there you can now enter shift plus f10 on your uh, keyboard and as you can see here the cmd command uh, uh, prompt window is right there let me just adjust it for you like this so as you can see here uh, what i am going to do is you can uh, enter into the any drive from there like for example enter d drive so capital d columns and enter so as you can see that we are inside the D drive right there so now if you want to see what kind of drive we have so it will give you the information of the drive as you can see that I have uh, directories inside of it so that means this is my uh, external hard disk which is currently connected to it you can also get the information of all the drives on your system by entering the uh, commands as you can see here uh, w mic logical disk get name and hit enter on your keyboard to get the detail of your the drives on your system 
so this is the information shown on the screen the different drives are available then again you can enter the drive and uh, after uh, entering the uh, drive uh, and uh, again enter the dir then you will get the and uh, look information of your uh, drive so basically i want to uh, back up my data from uh, internal hard disk to uh, external hard disk which is in this case is the d drive okay so uh, let me just uh, enter the notepad command right there notepad command make sure you type it uh, exactly i am showing you because if it is not typing well then you will get the error or cmd will not recognize it so open go to this pc and uh, as you can see here you are now uh, free to explore your uh, this pc or drives as well so here uh, is the all the drives and uh, you can if you don't know then you can simply click on the drives and you can check the data inside of it in this case the d drive is my um, external hard disk where i want to uh, uh, back up my all data so i have already backed up uh, my data which is a huge uh, load of file so it takes time because you can only uh, copy one file at a time so it will take time so and i have gigabytes of data to copy so i left intentionally i left a few files uh, to show you that how to uh, copy that so let me just uh, search for that file you can click all files to show all types of file which you want to uh, backup so uh, let me just uh, find out the folder there it is a uh, music project uh, so this is the fl studio folder a very little a small size folder which i'm going to show you here so right click on it copy now go back to the drive or external drive where you want to save that data and uh, here is the backup from pc i created this folder especially so you click on it and uh, just right click and paste it now the folder is inside my backup folder but you cannot see that folder because the page is not refreshed in order to do that you can uh, hit f5 the refresh button of on your keyboard to uh, bring the folder or you can make appear that folder inside the uh, external drive so one more time let me just give you the uh, example like these fonts this is the fonts which i am using or currently i'm using in microsoft office so i want to back that up as well small size folder just to show you the quick uh, access to the d drive which is my external drive again then right click and paste it inside of it again it is not visible hit f5 and the font folder will uh, as you can see the all the files are inside my external drive so this is the way that you can uh, easily copy everything uh, so as i told you that you, this is the huge uh, gigabytes of information which i have to back up so you are not able to drag and select everything at once so you have to uh, select one file at a time in order to copy that so as you can see here i am trying to uh, select multiple files or clicking and dragging is not also possible so one file at a time so this is how you can um, back up your data while installing windows through notepad so this is how easy it is so everything make sure you uh, back up everything and uh, nothing is uh, left then after backing up everything you are good to uh, go with the procedure of cleaning your hard disk and convert it into uh, convert it into gpd format so this is the window if you not if you don't have anything important in your hard drive to backup then you can proceed uh, with this uh, process right away without uh, pro following the procedure again hold uh, shift plus f10 to bring up the um, command manager enter disk part 
right like this again i'm telling you that uh, make sure you spell the word correct otherwise uh, cmd command prompter will show you the error so so far so good this part and uh, after entering this part you can enter list disk and hit enter so it will show you the disks as a level on your uh, computer so as you can see this is the unallocated space this is that means this is my uh, internal hard disk disk one is external so here you have to enter the disk uh, name so you have to select enter select disk let me show you that if you missed spell those things or you miss something then it will give you the error like this so that will help disk so it is not uh, the command so you have to enter the exact command as i'm showing you so you have to enter select and as you can see here the disk is with the capital disk and note o alphabet o is not there it is zero z e r o so you have to enter select a disk zero now it says that the disk zero is selected disk so we are good to go now is the time to clean the disk so enter clean and hit enter it will take some time to clean up things so there we go so disk part succeeded and cleaning is good now is the time to convert gpt convert space gpt so it is important so now the hard drive is converted into gpt as well so so far so good now is the time to exit so exit enter one more time exit and enter so now you are on the windows installation click it will bring you inside the installation procedure so select the window which you want to install okay then click in next so it will take some time so now you can accept the license go to next custom now as you can see here the unallocated space unallocated space the one terabyte of uh, space is now merged and we can easily make other partitions by entering the space size so for this i'm going to enter 250000 mbs size to create 250 gbs of space so no more error shown shown below as you can see previously i am getting that error that you are under the mbr format not in gpt so so wait for it it will create the partition of 250 gigs of space because i am uh, because i have entered the value 250000 mbs so that is why it is 250 gigs so now it is there so as you can see uh, we have some partitions created right there this is uh, unallocated space right there and this is the uh, space where i'm going to ins install my uh, windows so i hope uh, guys you find this a uh, video tutorial very helpful because uh, i made this videos just to show you that how to uh, save your data while installing windows so hope it helps you a lot so make sure you subscribe like share this video with your friends uh, so that uh, uh, it this video helps lots of other people at least you can hit the like button for me thank you signing out for now